Now to discuss how to make healthy complementary food with local ingredients. Of course, today we have in the studio Narendra Archi Prameswara, a professional chef who also is currently working together with UNICEF Indonesia to tackle or to help tackle this issue. Good morning, Chef Archie. Thank you so Good much morning. for being here. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> well, we have the ingredients already, but yep. um, I know that you have been working with UNICEF for about two to three months yep. to recently. be part of this uh, program called Ayo Masak Sehat. Sehat, yep. right? So you visited four regions in Indonesia so yep. far. And what are the re these regions um, and what do you see? Right. So we basically travel around the country mm. um, from Dari Sabang to Merauke, literally went to Sabang and then uh, Papua, yes. went to Timor, which is mm. the most southern part of Indonesia, mm. and then we went to Jawa Tengah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. And uh, we saw a lot of, a lot of things yeah? mm. uh, in regards to food, yeah. also uh, malnutrition, we, saw, yes. we literally saw with our own eyes the, the stunting problem mm. as a kid who, 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 were, who was wasted, not even stunting, yeah. and um, it's just by chance, by by accident. Mm. Yeah. And when you when you go there, mm. uh, what sort of ingredients that you find? For example, when you when you went to Aceh, mm. because stunting, when it comes to stunting, we talk about nutrition. Yeah. And uh, I am sure Indonesia, being a very you know like rich country in in, in a way that we have so many wonderful nutrition resources. So what did you find in Aceh that can actually be used to give better nutrition to babies in Aceh? All right. Um, for Aceh is uh, what they what they have, uh, what they're gifted with is the spices. Mm. They're given a lot of spices from the Indian influences back in the days. Mm. And this gives uh, the babies um, healthy and uh, it's actually an immunity booster. Immunity booster, yeah. that's the yeah. one in Aceh. Yeah. Do you remember what the rempah or the spices are? Yes, um, many many things like cinnamon, nutmeg, mm. they have cumin, they have uh, ketumbar or coriander, mm. they have uh, kunyit, which is mm. powdered. Mm. Yeah. And what about in Nusa Tenggara Timur or East Nusa Tenggara? Right, Nusa Tenggara Timur is, is interesting because they are not gifted with that amount of resources in other regions of Indonesia yeah. because it's an arid land, right. it's a dry land. Yeah. So not that many stuff uh, grows in, in South Tenggara Timur, mm -hmm. especially uh, in, in Timor where we went. Mm -hmm. uh, but they're gifted with these amazing ingredients that is, is very nutritious mm -hmm. uh, and can only f be found there. Such as? Such as this jagung we have here. <laughs> this is a uh, jagung wow. pulut. Jagung pulut. jagung pulut, it's so pale, it's not like a regular jagung, yeah. like usually jagung or corn is very yellow, mm -hmm. but this one is actually quite pale. Yeah, so it's mm. white in color, mm. this is high in carbohydrates, Right. so it's, um, it's a rice replacement, mm. so very very healthy, uh, but higher fibers, mm. lower in sugars, mm. and ah, uh, nice. yeah. And uh, it also, because of the, the dry land, mm. it has a uh, very good uh, soil for planting roots vegetable. Mm, such so, as? such as we have this um, is sweet potatoes, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. different colors. Yeah, yeah. beautiful. <laughs> different colors. And then, what and else? then. Uh, oh, this one is also very interesting. Yes. I don't think I've ever seen this. Look at how beautifully colorful. Can yeah. you see? This, this is, is so beautiful. What it's... is this? What what sort of beans are these? Mm. They call it kacang nasi. Kacang nasi. Nasi, because it looks like rice. Right. So it's, uh, it's tiny. Yeah. Uh, and it's since it's uh, it's 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 supposed to be mixed with mm. with the with the jagung, mm -hmm. so it makes a a, a rice uh, you know substitute. Right. The it's other way around, actually, rice substitutes this. Right. Because this was used to be the main food that people in Timor ate. Right. Yeah. So this is the thing. We have to, in a way, maximize what we yeah. have because Indonesia is so big, right? Mm -hmm. It's like mm -hmm. all different Oh, it's, it's amazing. It's a huge <laughs> country full of nutritious food. I and know. we have a stunting problem. Yeah. It doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make yeah. sense yeah. at all. You're yeah. absolutely right. Yeah. So today you're going to uh, demonstrate how to make a, a local food from East Nusa Tenggara, yes? yes? What That's is it correct. called? It's called uh, Bubur Jagung Bose Maktutu. Bubur Jagung Bose Maktutu. It's a long name. Huh? It is a long name, but if you happen to be in the region, 
you know, you might be able to taste this. So how do we make this? this okay. Is high in nutrition, obviously. Yeah. So uh, we'll start. Mm -hmm. First of all, we have this uh, pot. It's actually very easy. So mm -hmm. this food is, um, like I said before, it's a rice replacement. Yes. Or the other way around. Mm -hmm. um, so this, the jagung bose mm -hmm. in uh, in Timor, they call it jagung bose. Here we call it jagung bulut. Mm -hmm. Uh, pulut if corn. Yeah, pulut mm -hmm. corn. If you don't have this, you can use any uh, sort of dried corn. Mm. But this is better because lower in sugar and mm. higher in carbohydrates. Nice. Okay. Yeah. And this, we first um, mash it. Mash it. We take a small ah. sample, something like this, okay. until it becomes the result. Yes. Okay. So it's something just a like little this. bit. A little bit more, a little bit more um, a little bit fine, yeah. yeah. A little bit more fine, and looks a bit more like rice, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. true. <laughs> so that's what we're aiming for. Exactly. And then, and then now this is called uh, this is jagung bose mm. or the bose corn. This mm. is jagung bose maktutu. Crushed. Crushed, exactly. Ah, boom. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Maktutu is crushed. Maktutu is crushed. Local language, my yes. friend. Yes. <laughs> So this, uh, we put in the pot, uh -huh. and we mix it with the kacang nasi, kacang the beans, nasi. this is local beans. Beautiful. Look at the yeah. colors. If you don't have this, you can also use any kind of dried beans, mm. like red beans, um, yeah. pinto beans, Ooh, fava yeah. beans, anything you have. Mm. Um, beans, because we need proteins. Yeah. So just mix it in. Absolutely. So it's like making rice, and then we have water. water. Mm -hmm. This is, I have Ooh. one liter. Mm. The easiest way to do it is to soak this first uh, around 45 minutes in water. Okay. Hot so. water with, with salt no. or no? Just, just, just regular, regular water. water. Okay. Just regular water. Mm -hmm. And then we turn it on. Uh, we boil it. For about? For about, until um, it's, it's quite soft. Mm. So around an 45 an hour, 45 exactly. Minutes. Well, it depends like if that. you have pressure cooker at home, probably that's a little bit faster. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> depends on a lot of stuff uh, yeah. on, on timings and food is because yes. now right now in the studio, we have this um, induction cooker. Yes. If you're at home, you're using something else, it's yeah. going to be different. <laughs> but we're aiming for the softness of the, the corn. Okay. And then after this is cooking mm. uh, or it's soft, we mix this is the sweet potato. Yes, so three colored. Three colored, yeah. We have the uh, orange, uh, yellow, and purple. Nice, yeah. and you put it in. So very nutritious. Okay. And then we put it in. So lovely. Can yeah. you, I can already taste the sweetness from the sweet potato. Mm, without any sugar. Exactly, yeah. right? That's the best. What about that, the pumpkin, the kabocha? Yes, so the pumpkin and the uh, Sweet potatoes. Mm. Sweet potatoes cooks longer than a pumpkin. Ah, okay. So first we put sweet potatoes right. after it's done, mm. and then we put the pumpkin. The pumpkin. So this is we're using a uh, regular pumpkin, the right. yellow pumpkin. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh, we have a. Recipe. We have the recipe here. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> it's brilliant. Thank you so much, Miss <laughs> Producer. All right. So we put it in. Let's just pretend that this is done because. Yes. Uh huh. Um, oh, I forgot something. Is that ginger? This is ginger. Right. This is for the taste. Uh -huh. And what in, do you do with the ginger? Do you just Timor. bang it? Yes, we just uh. do it like this. Oh, nice. In Indonesian, we would say dimamarkan. Dimamarkan. Like you, you it, bang it. Yeah, this is to bring out the oils ah. so that the flavor of the ginger goes right into this bowl of goodness. Beautiful. Yeah. So, a bit of um, salt, perhaps? Yes, so after it's cooking mm -hmm. for a while, mm -hmm. we give santan, wow. which is coconut milk. Coconut milk. Mm -hmm. And the best coconut milk is when you make it out of the coconut. The coconut. Yeah. You the grate best. it yourself. You grate it yourself yeah. and then you mash it yourself and yeah. you, you, you squeeze it yourself. Yeah. It's the best, most nutritious, has uh, fat content, mm. which the babies need. Mm. Yeah, but natural... Um, Fat doesn't come from the oil because it has oil inside already. Mm, okay. So we put it in. Uh -huh. This is uh, to give also the sweet taste mm. of the coconut. We also infuse the it over here. The exactly, booty. exactly. The umami. The umami. Umami. Yeah. What about 
about this? You also have a spring onions and yes, celery. Yes, this, this goes later in the in the in the dish. Okay. And then after it's it's cooking, we just need to taste. All right. This is I have a, a salt <laughs> from. This is actually from Bali. From Bali. <laughs> yeah, from the Sales, the oh, northern nice. part of Bali. Right. So this is natural sea salt. Yeah. So just uh, give a quick stir. Yep. And that's it. And that's it. Very easy. Very easy, very simple. And in the end, we have something that <gasps> looks like... My, this. my, my. Have a look here. Camera. Yeah, camera. Boom. Can see it. Boom, boom, yum. So this is... So this is the end result. Wow. Uh, which has been cooking for about an hour. Oh, yeah. Plus, I added some egg. <gasps> this is to give another protein source. Right. Because we have first um, protein from mm. the, the beans, which mm. is um, mm. plant protein. This mm. is animal protein. Oh, look at that. Which is look important. Look at that. Well, can you see? Can you see? Yeah. Can you see? Yeah. <laughs> look how beautiful that is. What's the name again? I'm so hungry, I can't think, right? It's uh, Bubur Jagung Bose Maktutu. <laughs> Bubur Jagung Bose Maktutu yeah. from East Nusa Tenggara. Can I, yeah. first producer, can I just taste it? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so lovely. Oh, are you supposed to put yes, that on top? Yes, we put okay. this. Yummers. So it's more oh, it's, delicious. Oh, yummers. It has this. Look at that. Look at that, huh? Have a Lion look. Taste. This is this will be the first time ever because I've never been to East Nusa Tenggara. Yeah. And uh, so this is a privilege for me to actually taste the local food, which is very nutritious, and it's going to be one of the solutions to provide better, which we call it, nutrition for babies because yep. stunting is a big problem. Mm. I actually personally care about this issue mm. because I really do think that all babies, everyone, deserve to grow properly. Yeah. To have good quality of brain? Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. Yes. Right? Mm. Mm, oh God. Mm. Sweet, huh? Sweet without we don't use any sugars. It's amazing. Yeah. It's savory. It's savory. It's sweet. Mm -hmm. mm, you can taste the um, the taste of the the healthy fat from the coconut. Yeah. Mm. -hmm. mm. Mmm. Texture wise, mm -hmm. very interesting because it's like porridge. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, you have the nice bites from the kacang nasi. The beans, yeah. Everything. This is fantastic, chef. Oh my gosh. Thank you. So, this is part of the program of Ayo Masak Sehat, right? Yes. This Tell is... us a little bit about that program you're yeah. doing with UNICEF. So, um, we, we, we traveled around Indonesia. Mm, mm. The goal is to, to give uh, education mm. to, to the people. Mm. And how are we going to do it is we made a, 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 like a demo. Mm -hmm. A demo of how to cook nutrition, nutritious food mm -hmm. from each region. Right. So, because, uh, for example, like this kind of food, it's not easy to find if you're in Aceh. Mm -mm. Right? Mm -hmm. So every region has their own uh, local wisdom already, mm -hmm. and we're just trying to highlight it. We mm -hmm. wanted to show that you can actually feed this mm -hmm. to the babies. Mm -hmm. For example, this, this dish, um, it's, it's, it's everywhere in, in, in Timor, but nobody knows that you can actually feed this to the babies. Yeah. Mm. So what the babies ha uh, ate mm. is this processed food, which is mm. definitely not good. Awful. And uh, yeah, so we basically, we, we, we tell them, uh, we try to educate them that this is better. Yeah. Your food, your family food, the food yeah. that is on your table, you can also give it to the babies. Yes. By, uh, we use a saringan, a, yeah, a, a strainer, yeah, yeah, strainer. A strainer. we yeah. strain it so it's mm. uh, texture wise it's uh, suitable for babies mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and um, after that we, we, we made a video out of it yeah. so a kind of public service announcement and we made a book out of it as well. That's lovely, so yeah. a book of, of all of the recipes or, exactly. and also your journey? Uh, all of the recipes mm. and the, a lot of nutrition facts wow. in there as well that uh, we're going to distribute it all around uh, Posyandus oh, lovely. in Indonesia. Yeah. Oh, that's such such a good uh, mission that you guys are doing at the moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Speaking of nutrition, I'm just curious. Mm -hmm. Is there such difference between diet food and healthy food? 
definitely. Okay, absolutely. explain. Absolutely. Explain. <laughs> so um, there's this, I think there's this huge misconception that healthy means getting slim. Mm. Right? Okay. Okay. Doesn't always have to be that way. It's a sign if you're slim means that you're healthy, but it doesn't always mean that if you're slim, you're healthy. Yeah, yeah. You know? No. No. Uh, so all these diet food, this fat food, like uh, uh, let's for example shirataki, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, this is, it's actually, it tricks your mind mm -hmm. that you're eating food, yeah. but it's not. It has zero, zero calorie, right. means zero energy. You have zero energy, right. meaning you don't, you don't feel well. You, you cannot move that well, you cannot do exercise, yeah. and it's actually not good for you. Mm. What is healthy is something that looks like this. Yes. Which is, it has everything mm. in it. It has a lot of different sources. Mm. If you take, for example, like this is a lot of carbs, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like this is, has carbs, this has carbs. Uh, labu has, uh, pumpkin has carbs as well. Mm -hmm. But it's different carbs, a different composition, which we as a human yeah. uh, are omnivores. Mm. So we ought to eat that way. Yeah. Like an omnivore, not yeah. eating the same thing again and again, mm. over and over again. Salmon, uh, quinoa, again and again. Yeah. Yeah. Chicken breast, it's not good for you. Mm. But good for you is by Variety. doing Varieties, exactly. Okay, varieties. And yeah. it's all like beautiful uh, sources of protein as well, actually, because, you know, when you talk, you talk about protein, yes, of course, eggs is a source of protein because animal protein, but, you know, you can always find protein even also in vegetables. Yeah. Wow, thank you so much, Chef Archie, yes. for sharing. And thank you so I much wish you the me. very best with your mission with UNICEF. Thank you, thank you. I think it's a very noble mission that you're doing. Thank you very much. All right, well, we're going to have a quick break. When we come back, we will, uh, not we, actually, Paul, <laughs> we'll return with a recap from the world of sports.